Do you sometimes also feel like you're being hunted by these red lines underneath the words that you write? As a dyslexic myself, that is definitely my feeling. But luckily, nowadays, we can dictate to our devices. Just like this. Definitely. I find this extremely helpful. So I'm going to show you how you can use this function on your MacBook as well as on your iPhone. So let's start by looking how I achieved this on my laptop. What you want to do is you want to go to System Preferences, then you go to Keyboard, and then there's a Dictation tab. You click it, and you want to make sure that it's turned on. What I also did is I chose a custom shortcut. You can do that by clicking on Shortcut and then Customize. Or you choose some of these predetermined shortcuts for dictation. Then you go to a place where you can write something down, you press the shortcut, and now it should work. Now let's switch over to our phones and I'm gonna show you how you can do it there as well. So what you wanna do is you wanna go to Settings, then you go to General, then you go to Keyboard, and then you wanna make sure that this is enabled, Enable Dictation. If it's green, like here, then everything is fine. And you can go to, for example, your Notes app, and then you find a little microphone here down below. You tap it and then you can dictate whatever you want. I also find it especially helpful for different languages. So when you go back to keyboards, then here you can add keyboards for different languages. For example, I have one for German, Dutch and Hebrew. So now here on the globe, you can then switch to the different languages. So here I have, for example, German. And then I can also dictate in German. Also, wenn ich jetzt was diktieren möchte in Deutsch, dann geht das auch. In foreign languages, it's often even more difficult to find the right spelling. However, with this dictation software, you can spell anything. If this video was helpful to you, then do me a favor and give it a like. And uh, thank you for watching.